it's Mal and today we're going to do a bit of unboxing. I've eventually put my hand in my pocket and I've got my uh, new scouting machine. Here it is. I settled on the XP Deus. Great machine, I've done a lot of research on this and it ideally is going to match in quite well with the CTX and the Excalibur I've got. I've mainly got it for summer hunting and doing it onto the, the fluffy soil which the, the main labs don't really like so let's have a look and see what's in the box what we've got in the box here um, a few bits and pieces the usual we've got the comprehensive manual we've got the charger little control box the main beast itself we've got the uh, Little bits and pieces there, the charging leads, control box cover, main stem. I've gone for the WS5 headphones. Uh, I looked at the light ones and the sort of detecting I do, um, I don't really think they justify light detecting. Sort of like, so I've gone for the WS5s. And 11 inch coil. I uh, looked at the various coil options that are around and decided to go for the 11 inch one. I spoke to Nigel at Red, Redton's uh, quite a while about which one would uh, be suited for my style of detecting. So we went for the, the 11 inch one. So let's uh, get this beastie together and I'll come back to you once it's together and my final thoughts on how we're going to be using this machine over the coming years. Here we've got the little remote control unit. Now basically it's a switch on and go device. It's already got 10 little programs built into it and I'll cover most of the situations you find yourself detecting in. You might do a few little tweaks and just create some specialist little situation programs for maybe the beach. I'm definitely going to have a go and try and get a, a wet beach program improvements compared to what's already built in there. So we'll see what we can do over the next few punts. Now we've got the WS5 headphones, they're very, very comfortable. Uh, basically a switch on and go. Now you do need the remote control if you're going to change programs as far as I'm aware with, with the days, but all the other standard settings you can done, do here. So once you've set up your machine for the day, other than a few little tweaks, there's no real need to, to change anything. So looking forward to getting out in the field with these. I might have to change the, the volume slightly because I'm a bit corn beef as you all know. <laughs> So, um, I'll catch up with you in the hunt. So, all we've got to do now is really just get the the coil, the headset, and the remote control fully charged up. Then we can get out onto the, the fields for get onto some decent hunting weather. Well, guys, all we've got to do now is to get the coil, the remote control, and the headphones all charged up. So, I've got them all connected up with all the little connectors. So, just going to switch on the power, and away we go. So see you on the hunts. <laughs> 